Okay, we're just going to cover Bu Cell or Bu G, uh, the finger strike to the eyes. Um, if, I, if I was jabbing somebody's eyes here, I don't want to drive the fingers in because I could break my fingers, plus I can't type and uh, give people abuse. So if Josh was throwing a punch there, I'm just coming straight over with a slight side step. So if it goes again, there. Or I can go this side and use the eye jab there as well. So a technique with the bomb cell, if Josh throws the punch, I've got bomb, lap to the eyes, and then to come in again. So he throws the punch, bomb, and in. Or if he comes in again, it would be more or less like that, it would be a lot more quicker. Obviously when you're just training these techniques, you know, you just go nice and slow. You're just diverting his energy to come across. So if he throws that punch in quite quick, you don't actually see that bounce out with the eye jab. There. If he comes in again, just pack from the inside and come in. Okay. okay so you can use the eye strike and uh, a defence at the same time. So if Josh throws that punch there, I'm using the deflection, plus I'm going to the eyes. And I'm still using that little side step as well. So it comes in, there, comes in again. So that, 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 that strike's gone in. Um, if you look at my punch there, say if Josh has got the view, now I've probably got longer arms than Josh. He can get there, I'm stood straight, and my punch, can, it, it can't quite reach his face. And I've probably got a few inches on my length of arms. So if Josh grows his fingernails a bit longer, he'll probably catch us even better. So, so I'm coming in with a punch. So Josh is going with the strike here. So he comes in again. So I'll slight step. And he'll just catch the eyes every time. And that's all you need to really put somebody out of commission. And you've got to be careful when you're actually jabbing Fox's eyes because you could end up in jail. Um, so you've got to really think about what you're doing if he's actually going to do that, only if your life was in proper danger. <laughs> okay, so just comes with a punch. You've got a nice strike here, coming underneath. Okay, so he's there again. Yeah. Eye strike, coming underneath. If his hand's in the way, you've got his head again. So you're actually coming underneath with your eye strike. It's in your form here, coming underneath there. So if, I, if, we're, if we're in Buma to Buma, okay, Josh can pull that off by coming underneath here and you can use it again all the time. Yeah, so if, if you do that again, come underneath, come, and again, see, from, from there you can use the bomb cell, because I'm using pressure across to get in. And that's where these techniques come in, because you see the techniques in the grade and a lot of it. If, if Josh does a punch, you know, it's many one, two, three, but that's how you put it into practice. Okay, so if, if you're both in Mansell to Mansell, I'm coming, coming underneath to strike his eyes. And the eye jab, it's always just a flick, you know, in your form. Some people do it like this, you know, personally I, you know, really thrust them fingers out because that's what I'll be doing here. I'm coming underneath to get that strike in here, okay? So one there, coming underneath. If Josh delivers a, a bit of pressure there, then I'm going to go for a lap out because I can feel this pressure coming on. And then I've got the eye jab again to finish with an elbow. Don't forget to subscribe.